Hello, my name is Linda Crawford. I'm the Associate Director of Work Integrated Learning at Conestoga College. I have a short presentation for you to introduce you to Work Integrated Learning at Conestoga College. Work Integrated Learning, also known as WILL, allows you to get hands-on experience apply your classroom learning in a real life workplace setting and interact with employers and partners in the community. There are several types of will offered at Conestoga College, including field placements, professional practice placements, and industry-sponsored community-based projects. Cooperative education or co-op is also a form of work integrated learning. There's a separate presentation on co-op. This presentation focuses on will that is unpaid. A field placement is a practical experience which requires you to engage with a host organization outside of the college. Field placements are unpaid work experiences that allow you to apply what you have learned in class. A professional practice placement is similar to a field placement, but the hours that you complete during placement are required for licensure or registration with a regulatory body. Programs such as nursing and early childhood education have professional practice placements. Industry-sponsored community-based projects give students the opportunity to participate in real-life projects that will help employers and community partners with their business challenges. Prior to completing a WILL experience, there is some student preparation required. Your program coordinator, a faculty member from your program, or a representative from Will Support Services called a Field Placement Officer will provide you with details about what steps you need to take to be eligible for your Will experience. Students with a professional practice placement or a field placement in their program will take OHS 1320, an online workplace health and safety course that you will complete using eConestoga, Conestoga's online learning platform. Students need to complete this course prior to participating in a WILL experience. There are also other requirements that you might need to fulfill before beginning your WILL experience. These might include getting specific immunizations, TB or tuberculin testing, respirator fit testing, standard first aid CPR certification, and a police record check. These requirements vary depending on your program. Conestoga's Will Document Services Department supports students by informing them about the Will requirements for their specific program and how to complete those requirements. If you are an international student, you must have a valid co-op work permit in order to participate in any Will experience. This permit is different from your study permit. If your program has a Will experience, you can get information from the international office about the process to apply for a co-op work permit. The Will Document Services Department also assists international students with Will requirements. We encourage you to reach out to us as soon as you receive your program acceptance. We can provide information on completing the specific Will requirements for your program, as you can complete some of these requirements in your home country. Our contact information will be included in your acceptance letter. If you are a student with a disability or a barrier to learning, it is never too early to start thinking about how your strengths and challenges may affect securing or navigating a will experience. In order to discuss your needs further in a confidential setting and to explore all options from a strengths-based perspective, you are encouraged to book an appointment with an accessible learning advisor at Conestoga's Accessibility Services Department. If you would like more information about Will experiences or support from our Document Services Department, please feel free to contact us. We're looking forward to seeing you at Conestoga College. Thanks for watching.